Hey there, Titans. I'm your host, Eric Resendiz, and welcome to Titan Weekly, your information source for the latest news, trends, and events going on this week. Starting off with campus news, officials announced last week that CSU faculty will go on strike from April 13th through the 15th and also the 18th and 19th, unless their union agrees to their pay raise deal with the system administrators. Nearly 26,000 professors, lecturers, and librarians represented by the California Faculty Association will stop teaching and doing academic work in mid-April, officials said. We shall see if and how this affects our campus. The keynote speakers for this year's commencement have just been announced. Marielena Salinas, an anchor on Univision's national newscast, and Deborah Voigt, soprano opera singer and alumna of Cal State Fullerton. More than 60,000 are expected on campus that weekend for commencement. Voigt will serve as a keynote speaker on Saturday, May 21st, and Salinas will speak on Sunday, May 22nd. In entertainment news, the new film Batman vs. Superman Dawn of Justice will be released this Friday, March 25th. The $250 million film will kickstart the Justice League film series to compete with the Disney Avengers franchise, which made over $1 billion. In local news, Caltrans began a $1 million construction project on the 57 southbound freeway. Commuters who use the Lambert exit will need to resort to several detours due to weakened ramp closures. This project is in compliance with the Americans with Disabilities Act standards. SeaWorld announced that they will be shutting down their orca breeding program. Although the orcas that already live in the park will still remain there, they will be the last generation. Ever since the premiere of the documentary titled Blackfish back in 2013, SeaWorld's image was negatively affected. They decided that the best solution was to get rid of their breeding program altogether. Thanks for watching Titan Weekly. I'm Eric Resendiz. Tune in next week.